I'm Mark Cannon from Larchmont, New York. I play two pieces by Scriabin, uh, a crazy, late, complicated piece and a simple, early, simple piece. The late piece was the Ninth Sonata, which is uh, quite a challenge and uh, I'm not sure how much of the challenge I met, but uh, I had a great time up there with it and I hope the audience liked it. A lot, there's a lot of Scriabin uh, in the preliminaries. Why is that? Short? Things go in phases and uh, to some extent it's uh, perhaps pianists see that some repertoire has been relatively neglected and it's about time to give it some attention. But I think at times at least it also has to do with what's going on in the world. And uh, I'll, I'll leave out most of the possible details and uh, uh, deep interpretations, but just stay, uh, say that I think when things are uh, in upheaval and in turmoil and when there is great anxiety, that's the kind of time that perhaps the music of Scriabin might come into more favor. And what do you do in your real life? I'm a psychiatrist. <laughs> so how does, your, how does that kind of training play into thinking about the psychology of this whole thing and, you know, of a competition and preparing your work and everything? A lot of people have different theories about that and uh, a number of the people in this competition are people in mental health fields who uh, have ideas about that. Uh, I would say simply that they both deal with emotions and feelings and uh, uh, to me, actually, both activities seem to capture much the same things in me. So if you don't do well, or if you do do well, will you be overanalyzing yourself? Uh, if I do well, I'll be glad, and if I don't do well, I'll wonder why I didn't. I don't know that I'll get much deeper than that.